with Luis Alonso Alfaro. At this time, you have one charge, a felony charge of murder. On Wednesday, September 4th, 2013, officers were dispatched in regard to a stabbing incident at Spring High School located at 19428 North Freeway in Harris County, Texas. They identified the complainant in this case as a Joshua Broussard, who was a student at that high school. Uh, they developed the defendant here as a suspect in the case, and they made contact with him, during which time he gave a voluntary statement as follows. He stated that on that day, he had entered the cafeteria, he bumped a male student with his shoulder. The defendant said he exchanged words with the male student that he had bumped. The male student that he bumped into with his shoulder, shoulder area was then shoved by the defendant. Uh, the defendant stated that a black male <clears throat> student standing next to the right of the male that he had engaged in the shoving match with punched him to the left side of his face. The defendant said he began punching the black male who had punched him. He said the other males began punching him. He pulled a folding knife pocket, or excuse me, a folding pocket knife from his shorts and opened it. He said he covered his face with his left forearm and held the knife in his right hand. He stated that he swung the knife multiple times in a back and forth motion. He said he then fled the campus as the crowd began to disperse. Uh, the complainant suffered multiple wounds to the abdomen area consistent with a sharp edge instrument. The complainant had collapsed and died in a hallway near the cafeteria where the incident occurred. Officer also spoke to numerous witnesses on the scene who identified the defendant as having stabbed the complainant. Were there other people injured in the incident as well? Yes, sir. I believe there were three additional people injured. All right. One charge filed at this time there is probable cause. Your bond is set at $150,000. Are you asking for a court appointed lawyer? I'll send a request for a court appointed lawyer then to Judge Denise Bradley in the 262nd District Court, 262. All right, have a seat. Thank you. Back from the top of the docket, Mabel Emma Glover.